This is Cookie, who needs injections of Depacillin for an abscess. So I'm going to show you how to inject Depacillin. First of all, it's a suspension, so it's uh, made up of this white liquid which can get stuck on the bottom. So the first thing to do is give it a good shake. It's stored in the fridge upright so that the uh, medication is not in contact with the rubber stopper. So we always handle a syringe, not like they do in the films, holding it as if you're going to inject straight away, but like a dart or a pencil. Um, and near to the um, needle so that you've got more control of the thing. Pull the top off, oh, sorry, and uh, make sure that your needle is pushed on nicely. Holding close to the end, push it straight through the rubber stopper so that you don't bend the needle or blunt the end of it. Then, as you can see, it will stay put, at least for the first few months that you use it anyway until you've made a big hole in there. Then you can just pull backwards to your required dosage, which in this instance is going to be half a mil. So as you saw, I pulled well backwards and then pushed out any bubbles which will rise to the top. Um, you're not going to kill him by injecting bubbles under the skin, but it just makes it more accurate. Then you remove your needle straight again, and again, still holding it like a dart or a pencil with your hand well away from the bottom of the, uh, the plunger. We're then going to tent the skin up so that we make a triangle at the base in which to inject. Now, Cookie's got a bit of a skin condition, which makes it a little bit easier to see what we're doing. So we take a big handful of skin, and as you can see, that just tents it up at the bottom. Now, still, again, holding it like a pencil, we're just going to push through the skin, and you can feel it go through. And then you need to feel on the other side that you haven't pushed it through two layers, and then you can inject it under the skin. Okay, so I'm just going to show you that again with an empty syringe because he won't mind. Just pull it up at the base and then push the needle through. Okay, and I'm gen generally putting it in at 45 degrees and as you can see it doesn't hurt him to do that and then uh, as I say you can inject under the skin. There we go, and that's done.